Hello and welcome to a new Rush Hour episode of Trains At and today we're at Harrow and Willstone on the West Coast Main Line where you're seeing services from Avanti West Coast, London Northwestern Railway, London Overground, London Underground, maybe Southern and with any luck a little bit of freight as well. There are a pair of London Underground Bakerloo Line services with the one closest to Cameron now departing with a service bound for Elephant and Castle the other having just arrived. And then behind me is going to be a pair of Voyagers from the sounds of things. Well, 221101 was certainly leading. I haven't got the faintest, the faintest idea who's on the rear. Uh, but what I can tell you is they were running a service from Birmingham New Street to London Euston. And as that Bakerloo line service now heads off into the sidings, we'll then come back down to work a service to Elephant and Castle. So with that being all said and done, Let's see what else shall turn up. Okay, the next train to arrive is going to be the 1712 Southern Service from Clapham Junction to Watford Junction. Works by 377214. Fair few people on board, as then we're going to have passing by. Three fifty two six five and three fifty one oh four working a London Northwestern Railway service from Northampton to London Euston. Okay, the next one to pass by is going to be Devant West Coast Class three ninety Pennsylvania going from London Euston to Liverpool Lime Street. Works by three ninety zero four three is three seven seven two fourteen now departs with the seventeen twelve service to Watford Junction. Okay, the next train to make an appearance is going to be the 1717 London Overground service from London Euston to Watford Junction. Worked by one of their class 710s, and it is 710272. Yeah, the fans working overtime on that. And the brakes squeaking as well. Superb. As uh, also coming in is the 1717 London Overground service from Watford Junction to London Euston. Also worked by one of their class 710s. As coming in behind me is the 1717 London North Western Railway service to Tring from London Euston with former Transpennine 35404 leading proceedings. Uh, 350 112 is on the rear and uh, 710 376 is the London Overground unit. Fair few people on there, a lot of them looking very hot and bothered or just bored, or both. And I'm just out here melting, so you know, there you go. That's your, that's, that, that, that's your breaking news right there. Again, our parting is 710 376 with the 1717 London Overground service to London Euston. Next stop, Kenton. As also now departing is the 1717 London Northwestern Railway service to Tring. Okay, and the next train to arrive is going to be a terminating London Underground service, almost an Overground then, uh, Underground service from Elephant and Castle, Bakerloo Line service. Don't ask me to try and find the numbers on these things because I have no idea what I'm looking for. Thank you. 
lovely job. Okay, the initial train to pass by is another Avanti West Coast Class 390 going from London Euston to Manchester Piccadilly. Three ninety one oh four sparking away quite happily there. As now coming in is the return of the previous London Underground Bakerloo line service. That will then start a service from here to Elephant and Castle. I might just do a journey on the Bakerloo line, just to see what it's all like. I do an about turn to find what in theory should be a pair of London Western Railway Class 350s going from Birmingham New Street to London Euston. Three fifty one oh eight and three fifty triple one, giving it a fair amount of boot. I care about Richards Park now. It's going to be the London Underground Baker Loo Line service to Elephant and Castle. As behind me, we should see an event West Coast Class 390 going from Manchester Piccadilly to London Euston. Worked by 39154. Okay, the next train to pass by should be a duo of London Northwestern Railway Class 350s going from London Euston to Northampton. Three, two, five, four, and one, two, nine. So it's a trio. Then we're going to have an Avant West Coast Class three hundred and ninety passing by with a service from Glasgow Central to London Euston. As we have incoming the seventeen twenty eight London Overground service from London Euston to Watford Junction. That is three ninety one four eight. Here is seven ten two six five. As we also have incoming the 1727 London Northwestern Railway service from Tring to London Euston, worked by a duo of Class 350s, with the lead being 350 239. I shall get the rear when she departs. Okay, now departing is the 1728 London Overground service to Watford Junction. And then the 1727 London Northwestern Railway service to London Euston is now departing. On the rear is 350-123. Okay, the next train to pass by is going to be an Avanti West Coast Class 390 going from London Euston to Birmingham New Street. by 39126 and that service was knocked up uh, at the final hour so it was a very short notice for that service to be going to Birmingham okay coming back in or out from the sidings whichever way you want to look at it is going to be the uh, next London Underground Baker Loo line service to Elephant and Castle that'll be here for a few minutes and then at 1732 that should then be on its merry way. Right, and away she goes. I didn't actually realise that uh, what the time was. I thought it was going to be here for a couple of minutes and disappear, but it's uh, pretty much turned up. It was here for all of 30 seconds, maybe not even that. Uh, and then she be off. Not exactly giving it great guns, but still works. As the seagulls are kind of sort of doing their own thing around me. 
At least it's not pigeons this time, so that's no difference. Okay, the next round to pass by should be a duo of Avanti West Coast 2-1 Super Voyagers. In fact, it was just the one going from Hollyhead to London Euston. I was expecting that to be a duo, I must admit. Okay, the next round to make an appearance is going to be the 1735 London North Western Railway Service to Milton Keynes with 319-219 leader proceedings in its former Thameslink colour scheme. Bringing with it 319-217, as we also have coming in a terminating London Underground Bakerloo Line service. Oh, I can smell the electric motor on that one. That's uh, burning like a good one, as there is the 1734 London Overground service to London Euston, worked by 710268. It's all happening. It's still nice to see the 319s ply in their trade. Okay, 710268 is now departing with the late running 1734 London Overground service to London Euston. It's running about uh, a minute and a half late at this stage. Not that it's going to make a tremendous bit of difference. Okay, now departing is also the late running 1735 London North Western Railway service to Milton Keynes Central. As we're also going to pass by an Advanced West Coast Class 390. Three ninety one hundred three working service from Manchester Piccadilly to London Euston. Okay, the next train to be giving it the beans will be an Avant West Coast Class three hundred and ninety going from London Euston to Glasgow Central. Three ninety zero eleven for the owners of that one. Then we have three fifty one one six. And 35251 working a London North Western Railway service from Milton Keynes Central to London Euston. Yeah, from Milton Keynes to London. Okay, well, the two tone there from a pair of London North Western Railway Class 350s will be 35250 and 35266, complete with the way from the driver, working a late running service from Crewe to London Euston. As up in the distance is a terminating London Underground Bakerloo Line service. Then in theory, the one in the siding should be coming out at the same time. What's the time now? Yes, well the one that's in the siding should be coming out and then, for all intents and purposes, departing almost immediately if it's to stick to the timetable. I do love the sound these make over the points. Quick look behind me. Uh, no, the other one is still up in the sidings. So, well, you know, I kind of guess that'll just do their own thing. A nice gentle stop. Okay, the next train to pass by is a duo of London North Western Railway Class 350s. 35406 and 249. And I seem to have had a complete meltdown there when I was saying the word London Northwestern, but there we go. Okay, Couldn't get me, uh, so, get me words out. But they're running not well, oh, non stop, they're running fast from London to Tring. Okay, then now departing about three minutes late will be the London Underground Bakerloo Line service to Elephant and Castle. Not that I imagine that's going to make a blind bit of difference. It'll probably, well, it may even make up those three minutes at some stage. Bit uh, battered on the rear there. Okay, the next train to make an appearance should be an Advanced West Coast Class 390 from Preston to London Euston. 390. With a fair amount of wind, there is 39136. Okay, the next two services to arrive will be London Overground services. The first is going to be the 1747 from Watford Junction to London Euston. The second will be the late running 1745 from London Euston to Watford Junction. So, 710261 is the London bound service.
So she comes to a gentle halt and then the Watford bound service is going to be 710378. No idea. Hendo. We'll find out in a moment. Okay, here we have three ninety one five seven, giving it a bootful as it runs a service from Liverpool Lime Street to London Euston. Whenever those trains go past, they kick up a lovely breeze. Okay, the late running 1745 service to Watford Junction has disappeared, about three minutes late. Yeah. And the 1747 is still sat here, that'll be, it is now two minutes late. It's now just ticked over to 1749. And unless that's waiting for a gap in the signal block from the late running Bakerloo line service before that. Just keep it rolling. I think I'll have to. Right. <laughs> yeah. Right then, now departing is the uh, late running 1747 London Overground service to London Euston. Okay then, now departing, bang on time, is the 1753 London Underground service to Elephant and Castle. Okay, the next train to make an appearance will be... three ninety zero four two. giving it what for from London Euston to Glasgow Central. Okay, the next train to pass by will be another event West Coast Class 390 going from Preston to London Euston. And that is worked by three ninety zero four five. And there is that ever so loving breeze. Okay, we've got two services coming in here. The first is going to be the late running 1756 London North Western Railway service from Trin to London Euston. And then the second is going to be the 1758 London Overground service from London Euston to Watford Junction. So leading this is 350109. Over here we have uh, 378. Ooh, I'm not sure about that one. I'll have to, I'll have to get back to you. Right, then it's going to be a London to crew bound pairing of London Northwestern Railway Class 350s. One hundred four and 2.65. Okay then, getting ready to depart is going to be the late running 1756 London Northwestern Railway service to London Euston. As it is 378.212 heading to Watford Junction. These units do look good when the sun's bouncing off them. On the rear is 350-267. Okay, the next one to pass by is either going to be a duo or a trio of 350s bound for Northampton. Three fifty triple one and one one eight. Giving it great guns. Okay, the next train to disturb the peace is going to be a terminating London Underground service. Doing about turn to find incoming the eighteen hundred Southern service from Watford Junction to Clapham Junction, worth by three seven seven two fourteen. Okay, the next train to pass by should be a duo of London Northwest Railway Class 350s. 
102 and 240, working a service to Birmingham New Street. Okay, to Barton now is 377 214 with a late running 1800 Southern service to Clapham Junction. Very few people on board. Slightly confused as to why they didn't uh, double this one up, as there was another seven, uh, 377 parked up at Watford when uh, I picked up my London Overground service. But clearly, Southern know what they're doing. Okay, the next train to make an appearance is going to be the 1804 London Overground service from Watford Junction to London Euston, worked by one of their Class 710s. And I like the fact that Okay, this is worked by 710-272. Marginally squeaking. Okay, 710272 is now departing with the bang on time 1804 London Overground service to London Euston. I can hear something. What on earth? Oh, hello. Three fifty three six eight and three fifty one two one, working a service from London Euston to Milton Keynes Central, with one of the weirdest sounding tones I've recorded in a fair old while, but I'll take it. Okay, our first freight train of the evening should be a pair of Freightliner Class Nineties going from Crew Bass Hall to Felixstowe. Ninety zero fifteen leading. Predominantly fresh air, but with a cracking tone from the driver. Thank you very much. And sparking like an absolute beauty under that bridge. I can hear noises. Sounds like a 390 to me. It's a 390. I have no idea what number and I have no idea where she's come from. All I can tell you with absolute certainty is it's bound for London Euston. That's about as informative as it gets. Okay, the next train to make a bit of a bracket will be a terminating London Underground Bakerloo line service. I know people have told me in the past where to look for the numbers on these things, but I really cannot for the life of me remember. Oh, and that um, mystery 390 was going from Birmingham New Street. Okay, the next train to make an appearance will be another Avant West Coast Class 390 bound for Lancaster. Three ninety one three four one five four even. Again, sparking lovely underneath uh, that bridge. I have no idea what this is. Three ninety one four eight, I think. Uh, no idea where it's going, wasn't even expecting it. So, yeah, doing about turn, we will then find a pair of 350s going from Northampton to London Euston. Three fifty one two two and three fifty two five two. Again, spiking quite nicely under the bridge. I think I found a little decent spot here for uh, catching the old sparks. As over there is the unmistakable sound of the doors closing on the London Underground Bakerloo line service heading for Elephanton Castle. Not exactly brimming to capacity at this stage of proceedings, but I imagine once that hits the uh, city centre, ooh, nice spark there from the uh, from the third rail. Yes, I imagine once it hits the uh, proper big areas of the city, then it'll uh, become unbearable. Okay, the next train to pass by is another Vance West Coast Class 390. Three ninety zero fifty, going from Manchester Piccadilly to London Euston. The other three ninety was going to Manchester Piccadilly. Then, in theory, the next three ninety should be the Liverpool-bound service. 
Okay, they're now approaching is the aforementioned Liverpool bound of anti West Coast service, but by one of their class 390s. Three ninety one three seven. Nice little time from the driver there. Thank you very much. Okay, the next round of bigger appearance is going to be the eighteen fifteen London Overground service from London Euston to Watford Junction. Worked by one of their class seven tens in the form of seven ten two six six. Squeaky break time. I can hear something. I can see something. So this will be. This must be the 1817 London Northwestern Railway service to Tring with 35123 leading proceedings. On the rear is 35239. It's not chock a block, but there are a fair few people on board. Yeah, okay, the next train to pass by is going to be 35256 and 245, working a service from Northampton to London Euston. As also coming in is going to be a London Overground service from Watford Junction to London Euston. I'm not too sure on the time, so I will just have to double check that when I get the opportunity to. It is worked by one of their Class 710s. Probably one we've seen before in the form of 710265. A lovely gentle stop there. As we're doing about turn now to find the 1817 London Northwestern Railway service to Tring departing. Right, the next parting is the 1817 London Overground service to London Euston. Uh, oh, hello. Behind me should be a GBRF 66 going from Birch Coppice. 66758. Colourful mixture of containers on there. Uh, it's also coming in, it's going to be a terminating London Underground service with a really knackered front end as a helicopter passes overhead. Okay, the next one to pass by should be a duo of 221 Super Voyagers going to Wrexham General and Hollyhead. Just the one. It's two to one, one ten. I am surprised by that. I thought they would have uh, stuck a pair on that one. Okay, the next train to leave is going to be a London Underground to Bakerloo Line service to Elephant and Castle. They do look tired, I think is the best way to describe those. Okay, the next train to pass by should be a duo of London Northwestern Railway Class 350s going from London Euston to Northampton. It's either going to be a duo or a triple, depending on how they're feeling. So leading is 350251. With 350116 bringing up the rear. The breeze is just getting more and more welcoming as the evening progresses. Right then, the next train to back appearance is going to be the 1728 London Overground service from London Euston to Watford Junction. 1828, you mean? 
Oh, I do mean 1828, you're on the ball, well done. Right, this is going to be worked by 710376. I don't know why I got 1720 in my head, but it works. Okay, the next train's passed by. Looks like another duo of London North Boston Railway Class 350s are going to be working a service from London Euston to Northampton. Running in quick succession with the other Northampton service, which I find surprising. Right, 266, 250 and 128, so that one is the trio. Okay, as my autofocus does its own thing there. There goes the uh, 1828 London Overground service to Watford Junction. Okay, the next train to pass by should be a duo of London North Western Rubber Class 350s going from Birmingham New Street to London Euston. One twenty and two four eight. Certainly not hanging about. Okay, the next train to pass by should be an Avanti West Coast Class three ninety going from London Euston to Manchester Piccadilly. Works by three ninety one three six. Okay, the next round to make an appearance is going to be the 1830 London North Western Railway service from Tring to London Euston. Leading the way will be 350 112. I will then get the rear when she departs. Someone's bike was a bit too close to the edge of the platform there for my liking. Okay, the next train to pass by will be an Avanti West Coast Class 390 from Edinburgh to London, Euston. And that is worked by 390002 as up in the distance goes a uh, London Underground service to Elephant and Castle. As also coming in is a London Underground service from Elephant and Castle to terminate here at Harrow and Wealdstone. Oh, and I don't know if I mentioned, but the um, GB66 that was going from Birch Coppice was running to London Gateway. Yeah, and the 66 was from Birch Coppice to London. I have a parrot behind me, apparently. Okay, that's parting is 350112 with the 1830 London Northwestern Railway service to London Euston. On the rear is former Trans Pennine 350 404. Okay, the next train to arrive is going to be a London Overground service to London Houston. I have to get the time suite when she departs, as also coming through should be, it should be a duo, but I'm not going to hold my hopes up, of Avanti West Coast 2 to 1 Super Voyagers from Hollyhead to London Houston. Giving it the beans on that one, I can safely say. And there is 710378, so I shall get the departure time when she departs. Okay, that's departing is the 1734 London Overground service to London Euston, as we should then have some Avanti West Coast 221 Super Voyages passing by, bound for Shrewsbury. Two to one one oh nine and two to one one oh one. So that is the pair that I captured earlier that I couldn't get the numbers off. So that uh, <laughs> that rounds up that one quite happily. Okay, the next round to pass by is a very smoky sixty six. Sixty-six 
6.540 with a great two tone working a lightly loaded container train from Distant O'Connor to Felixstowe. As also coming in should be the 1837 London North Western Railway service from London Euston to Milton Keynes Central worked by Power Class 319s. So I'll happily take these. That's what I said. Yeah, 1837 London North Western Railway service from London Euston to Milton Keynes Central being worked by Power 319. I definitely have a parrot. <laughs> So, leading proceedings is 319.005, complete with a wave. Then you have 319.457. There goes an Avant West Coast Class 390 Pendolino, giving it great guns bound for London Euston, but I'm not entirely sure where she came from, so I'll have to check that one out later on. Okay, it's quite an hour, it's the 1837 London North Western Railway service to Milton Keynes Central. It is great seeing the 319s ply in their trade. It will be a shame when they ultimately go. Okay, the next train to give it great guns will be another Avant West Coast Class 390. <laughs> 390 sparking beautifully as it works a service from London Euston to Glasgow Central. Okay, the next freight train to pass by is going to be another GBRF 66 going from Trafford Park to Felixstowe. And this is 66781. Fully loaded and very colourful. Always great to see a fully loaded container train. Okay, the next train to disturb the piece is a terminating London Underground Bakerloo line service as we do an about turn to find a pair of London North Western Railway Class 350s. Two three seven and three seven two working a service from Crew to London Euston. Oh, that's a very nice breeze. More of that, please. Okay, the next train to pass by is the Metro West Coast Class 390. It's 390 103. Uh, fudge. I should know where that's going. I looked earlier. Um, cool, blimey. I want to say Manchester, but I'll have to double check that one. Okay, the next round to pass by should be a duo of 350s from London to Tring. Two six seven and one oh nine. And there goes two three four and two six four. The uh, first two with a tragic two tone from London to Tring. That one from oh, I have no idea actually. Probably Tring to London, but I uh, I will double check that. Okay, coming in now is the 1845, uh, it's going to be a late running 1845, London Overground Service from London Euston to Watford Junction, worked by 710268. It's now running a minute late. Although, to be fair, anything running under five minutes late in the UK is deemed as on time, so, you know, it's running on time, for the all intents and purposes. Complete with squeaky brakes. Okay, now starting is the LA running 1845 London Overground Service to Wofford Junction. As also coming in is the 1847 London Overground Service from Wofford Junction to London Euston, worked by the 378. Viva, uh, 1845 as well? Nope, try again. There you go. Uh, London Overground Service <laughs> so this is the return of 378 to 12. Uh, London Euston, Wofford Junction being worked by the return of the 378 to 112. Uh, 112. Uh, Try 212. Okay, it's passing a minute late. Shock. Is the 1847 London Overground service to London Euston.
Okay, our final train of the day is going to be a terminating London Underground service. Uh, yeah, I'm not even going to try and give you numbers. I don't know what I'm looking for. I know somebody, have, you've, you've told me countless times when I've filmed London Underground trains that there's a way in which to identify them, but I am absolutely buggered if I know. But as uh, she comes to a graceful stop, I shall leave it there. Thank you all very much for watching. It is greatly appreciated. Oh, hello, here comes the other one. It goes without saying. If you have enjoyed what we see today, then please do like and subscribe. Feel free to leave a comment. I do go back to them as and when I get the opportunity to. Thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed filming here at Harold Millstone. It's the uh, first time doing a rush hour film here. It would be nice if there's a bit more freight running around, but yeah, you, you can't have all your own way. What I did get was brilliant. Uh, catching the 290s, well, I must admit, I wasn't expecting that. I honestly thought they were going to be, well, it was going to be worked by 66. As we have a pendo heading north, I have no idea where. That is 390.009. That's um, our next rush hour film is going to be. Uh, where am I going to go? I'll go to London King's Cross. That'll be my next rush hour film. That uh, joining me today was John Trainspotter. I'm sure you probably heard him multiple times throughout the course of the film. Uh, often referred to as the Parrot. So uh, do check out his channel. Uh, he's uh, new to the scene, but uh, he's got uh, great passion for the hobby. And uh, his films are getting better and better with each passing time. So please do go and check him out and give him as much support as you can. So away goes an elephant and castle bound Bakerloo line service. So until next time, from me here at Harrow and Willstone, I shall see you all later. Take care, guys. Goodbye.